Hello guys, Nano Figure Review, and today I'm doing my Batman One Full Scale Neck Figure. By neck, I mean. Bleh. Um. So here we go. Here's the packaging. This thing is huge. Really, obviously similar to the Iron Man Mark uh, Seven. So Mark Seven, yeah. And uh, it just looks damn cool, man. Let me just move iPod and this obviously this is the Michael Key one, the A9 version. So yeah, the packaging looks really nice, man. That's the symbol, the iconic symbol. This is Batman. And you can see in the packaging Mike Key and Batman. There's three reviews out there, but nothing major. And here's some side artwork. Looks pretty cool. Over here. More I'm saying Batman. More over here. And at the top it just says Batman again. So says Neca. Ooh, ooh, it's dropping. So yeah, so and the cool thing is showing his suit and the the TDT belt um, that's why I believe it's going and it just looks so cool man I'm really happy to get it so enough looking at the packages let's take out the, out the packaging okay take a little pause hi guys welcome back and uh, finally uh, took out the packaging and wow look at this Look at that bad boy. Zoom in. Look at that. So much detail in it, man. Wow. I used to have the 89 uh, DX09 Mikey and the Hot Toys one, but this one, wow. So I saw that one, unfortunately. But yeah, but I, I still prefer that one. But, but this one is not half bad, the, the likeness of my key in, but wow. And when I first took out the packaging, it was not kind of easy taking it out because, you know, these kind of figures are big. That's the problem. And uh, NECA, you know, they, they don't give a stand with these kind of figures. But I heard they're going to do something now. So yeah, but it look, overall looks nice. Um, the paint application is pretty much all black, of course, just like the A9 version. And the head sculpt, the cow with my key in it. The mouth uh, looks a bit funny, but it's nothing major. But, you know, it's, it's him under there. So, yeah. But they, they made the, the face sculpt, um, obviously, Caucasian male because my key is Caucasian. I believe, or was he something else? I don't really know, <laughs> but uh, well, yeah. Um, so yeah, and the bat symbol looks really cool. Let me just zoom in. Focus, focus. And the utility belt is really nice. That's all all yellow, by the way. Pretty much, but it's like really yellow. My my one's got some paint drips over there. Unfortunately, I just noticed that now. Fortunately, uh, so it's really nice. Got the, the yellow background and the bat symbol there. The bat symbol is a bit different on the 89 version, of course. Uh, that's how it is in the movie. Um, the cape's really nice. It's like a, um, I, I wouldn't say leather. Um, the hot toys one was not leather. It's like a. It looked like leather, but it was like a wool thing. So it's pretty much the same thing. It's already caked in there, so you don't have to do any necessary parts. Um, I love his boots. It's black uh, Nike boots. Everybody keeps saying. And uh, yeah, it's all it's all nice, man. And uh, this is his default fists. See the detail on that. I'll show you more in the accessories. 
and uh, yeah, and the body armor, um, it's pretty cool. It's got like this rubber texture, so it's really cool. And he's got his back uh, gauntlets over here. Let me show you. Rubbery texture, so that's pretty cool. Hold on, I got a feeling he's gonna drop. Oh, really nice on that department. And uh, yeah, and let me show you the back. Um, it's all good over here. Let's take this. It's got a nice this black texture as well. You can see his butt. See the leg joints. So yeah, really cool. Okay, let's put it there. Really nice. I'm really impressed with this figure, man. And they showed it the, uh, the Toy Fair uh, 20, ooh, 2013, the New York Toy Fair this year. So when I first saw the photo, I'm like, what? They're releasing the NECA one? Really? I like I had to get it. And obviously the 1966 Batman is out now, but I'm not getting that, of course. There's three reviews out there already with that figure. And, uh, yeah. So yeah, so that's really cool. So uh let's go on the articulation department now. If I can do it. So he's got some articulation on his leg. Do this. Oh, I can't. Whew. That's the biggest stuff. Okay. Let's try again. He's got some. He's got some. Uh, okay. Okay. Maybe. I'm thinking. I think I'm gonna break it like that. So. Okay. I think his leg kind of stiff right now, but I don't know. But oh gosh, that was hard. Let's try again. Hold on. I know I can do this. He's got some tickleish on his leg. It's kind of stiff. <laughs> okay, so um, let's not talk about the on his leg joint over here. Okay, I think that's not gonna move. Um, but his fire leg does articulate. It's got a nice joint there. Okay, this part. You can make him do the space if you want to. Or and uh, leg articulation, no, still can't do it. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna get the other part. Uh, Toss articulation, uh, not really. But I'm using this by one hand now. Can we try the this is hard man because my tripod's not tall enough. Head articulates barely because the cow you know gets in the in the way. And uh what was going to talk about? This is I'm doing I'm, I'm having a hard time doing this guys, so bear with me. Hand articulates my three sixty joint and uh yeah, let me just put this back. It's so, it's so, this is so awkward, man. Oh, let's put it back. Uh, foot articulates okay. 360. Ankle pivot, not really. But I'm trying to figure why the. Okay, it does articulate. Look. <sighs> You have to use a bit of force, but let's see, it's like a 90 degree angle. I could do it that much. Oh my gosh, that was so tough. And yeah, that's it on that articulation. 
Let's just put his arms back. And he's got a nice bicep articulation as well. If I forgot to mention that, I will show you. So you can see the joints there. So that's really cool.